Ah, the good old grandfather's clock, a timeless piece of furniture that adds elegance to any room. But have you heard about the grandfather's paradox? the age-old time travel paradox that goes something like this. What if you went back in time and killed your own grandfather before your father was born? Well, that sounds like a conundrum, isn't it? If you kill your own grandfather, then your father wouldn't have been born, which means you wouldn't have been born, which means you couldn't have gone back in time to kill your own grandfather in the first place. This paradox has been studied by theoretical physicists and philosophers and there are several proposed solutions to it. One solution is the many worlds interpretation of quantum mechanics which suggests that time travel would create a new parallel universe in which your grandfather is killed but your own existence is preserved in a different parallel universe. In the past we would imagine time as line where the past and the future extends opposite to each other and the present being the midpoint on the line. Newton proposed the concept of absolute time which flows everywhere in the universe. So if you killed your grandfather, it would result in infinite possibilities about your future and multiple outcomes depending upon your grandmother's future. One possibility is that you would make attempts to kill your grandfather but certain circumstances will lead in saving the life of your grandfather and your existence might or might not be saved. So it's just a theory not a paradox. The loop goes on and on with so many indefinite solutions. This paradox mainly attacks the possibility of time travel and its inevitability. If you go and kill your grandfather, you will not cease to exist. Time will not implode and no paradox will be there. Time will move forwards without any hindrance with respect to time travel. But you will exist in the present as an adult. You will also exist in other universe. Not the same you, but a little different version of you. With so many theories and possibilities and with the hypothetical wormholes, it's hard to get down to the solution. Ah, uh, I respect my grandfather. Rest in peace, your loving grandson, Rohail Khan.